So to explain filter mode and our drum tune, we just look at the centre frequency of this drum, the fundamental 124 hertz B2. Now, depending on the drum and the skin and the wherever I hit it, this will pick up a number of different frequencies. So it can be a bit spurious. Um, so if I want to actually lock on to a certain frequency, I, and I know roughly what it is. For instance, if I want to tune around the edge of the drum, and I know that's around 195 hertz, if I press the filter on at that point, it will now only pick up those frequencies. within that region. So it allows me to sort of home in on a particular frequency range that's of interest when tuning. Now if I look at the, um, I'll just, just switch the filter mode off, if I look at the frequencies in the spectrum view mode, so let's take a reading from the center. Now this reading shows me the fundamental of the drum, 127 hertz, and the first overtone at 191 hertz. Now when I press filter mode, I can home in on any one of those two frequencies. So I can home in there on the fundamental, or I can press it again and home in on the overtone, or I can press it again and we'll switch off. So if I want to tune around the fundamental, I can select there. If I want to tune around the overtone, around the edge, I can select there. Or if I just want to see everything, I can select there. So that shows the uh, capability of filter mode and iDrum tune. And hopefully that's really useful in order to, to tune your drums around the edge, but also to tune up the pitch of the drum and your fundamental as well.